We're here today at uh, Cat Plant in, uh, in Barnsley. Uh, it's the Finley Open Day. We have uh, a host of new products and models to, uh, to show our customers and also dealers here at, the, uh, at this venue. Uh, we have seven new machines uh, on site along with some of the existing products. Uh, we have dealers and customers represented from not only the UK but also from a number of export territories including Denmark, Norway, Poland, uh, Latvia, Russia and also a new dealer from Austria. Yeah, I think things are going great. We've put a lot of work, Terex Finley have put a lot of work into the, uh, to the couple of days that we're going to show. We're hosting it in our limestone quarry that's at near Doncaster in uh, South Yorkshire. Uh, and we're hoping for a good day. I think the weather's going to be good. This is our C1545 model. It's the newest model just released there to the market. This is the first uh, machine coming into the UK. It's our middle sized cone. It's an 1150 diameter or 45 inches. It's direct driven from the engine. Uh, it's got higher reduction ratios, clamping forces, giving the customers better aggregates and, and a very good shape. Uh, we've bought the i100S to replace an existing T Sab 623 and a Finley Supertrack 683. Currently, we have a contract with Tarmac to produce 10 mil wrap for addition back into Tarmac. And this unit allows us to do that in one pass, whether it be reject or whether it be road planings. The other reason we bought the machine is the screen box is dropped off within 15, 20 minutes. And then we've got an independent secondary impactor to increase our sales of single size aggregates. The relationship between Terex Finlay and Spalik goes back to 2013. We've been building screen boxes for Terex Finlay for six different types of mobile screeners. There's been over 100 of these models sold onto markets in Europe, North America, Australia, into all different types of branches from scrap metal, car recycling, incineration ash, demolition, and today the machines are working in concrete recycling and in ag lime production. Today the show we have our new Terex Finlay I-140 heavy duty crusher. The rotor in this crusher is 1.3 metres in diameter by 1.25 metres in width. It also has fully hydraulic aprons. The machine is powered by a 500 horsepower engine with a direct drive to optimise fuel efficiency. To achieve maximum throughput and to reduce blockages, each component, feeder, independent pre-screen, crusher and anti-discharge belt are increasing in width. The 873 recently introduced machine, it is a more compact version of the 883 Plus. Um, also lighter and easier to transport, approximately about five tons lighter. However, for a compact machine, the screen box still remains a full five foot wide, so we've got a 12 by five top and bottom deck, which is wider than any of the competitors. And the screen box still accepts the screen media, all your various screen media from an 883 or an 883 plus. A lot of the options like extended conveyors, chassis riser, hydraulic stockpiler drives that you'd be familiar with from 883s and 883 pluses also carry over to the 873. The benefits of using the Terex Finley I100 RS are that it's a very easy feed system with, with a vibrating feed at the start, a pre-screen that we can take either the fines out the side or we can drop the fines underneath the crushing chamber to remove them before they go through the crushing chamber because that's good to cut down the wear. Into the fine finishing screen and any oversize that we have then we can recycle it back round again and that gives us a finished product. We have a three bar and four bar rotor system for this machine. This particular machine is a four bar rotor with two high and two low bars in it so that way we don't have to worry about creating a lot of fines. It also can handle rebar and various other small parts of metal that we can then take off of the magnet to give you a good clean product at the end of it. One tractor unit and low loader can then move this from site to site very economically and so benefits the end user from having to use two sets of transport, two engines and that saves them a lot of money and makes them more competitive in the marketplace. This is our new C1540 standard machine. It's going to be launched early January 2016. 
It's a direct drive 40 inch cone. It's the standard version without the option of the pre-screen which we have in the market today. We run some uh, Terex Finley, some Super Track 693, 694 screens uh, and we're looking to invest in some more, some more Finley kit as well in the, in the near future.